it's not still 2020, but the United States House of Representatives now finds itself impeaching outgoing President Donald J. Trump once again. And as this is history, both NBC and ABC chose to cover the House activities live. Therefore, some soap operas were not seen. Days of Our Lives was pre-empted across the country but this soap likes staying on schedule and will put today's episode on NBC.com by Wednesday evening. However, General Hospital will now be two days behind schedule as it was already pre-empted last week after the deadly insurrection at the U.S. Capitol. The soap pushed last week's episode back in day and has now tweeted that today's episode will air tomorrow. So, you won't have to miss a moment of Abigail and Chad's romantic troubles on Days of Our Lives or what will become of an amnesiac Sunny on General Hospital. Tune in online in tomorrow for more soapy drama. Soap opera began in the early 1900s, as radio broadcasts. Soap companies were behind the conception of the daytime dramas because they wanted to sell soaps to stay-at-home moms. They did their job and also launched a lifelong programming format, the soap operas. Spanning more than five decades, American Sudsers have seen the rise and fall of daytime soaps. In the heyday of soaps in the early 1980s, there were up to 13 different soap operas broadcasted. However, over the years, the number has declined. Currently, there are only four American soap operas on the air. The four remaining soap operas currently on the air include Days of Our Lives, The Young and the Restless, General Hospital, and The Bold and the Beautiful. Check your local listings for airtimes.